Okay, I'm back again there. Okay, this looks much better. Okay. Um, I want to see if I can find any more of these stone steels. Oh, also, there's an evening classic, apparently. Oh. oh, you're the special vote the guard was talking about. My name is Ashai. I'm in charge of teaching the Vo and you class to the Gerudo. <laughs> have you set your heart on someone special? I have! <laughs> you don't hold back anything, do you? Most Fi value honesty in a Vo. That's a good trait for you to have. You're welcome <laughs> to sit on a lesson if you're interested. Vo aren't normally allowed in town, so it would be a rare treat for the class if you showed up. Maybe you could come in by in the evening? That class is for the older Gerudo. The day daytime class is for the younger students. I don't think they're quite ready to meet a bow. Fair enough. <laughs> oh, goodness. Okay. Might be some down here. I guess. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Get back up there. <laughs> there it is. Okay. <laughs> um, there are some pieces of equipment I want to use. There's a lot of stuff, okay.
Check out the one that I unlocked. Oh. Um. I should 
could trade out a bow, but which, which? Let's go with the mighty construct, drop it. I don't need that, get the royal bow, yeah. seem to be enemies here. it out into the Seven, though. Better attack. Drop this one. things. I didn't expect to see you here. But then, you always show up in unusual times. Oh. 
So Hyrule Castle rose up into the sky. Zelda vanished right in front of you. And now you come here looking for clues. Hmm. Link, I understand how you're feeling. Zelda is a dear friend to me as well. I will do everything in my power to help you. But to do that, I need to bring a quick resolution to a problem we Gerudo are facing. I'm sure you noticed that the desert is even more difficult to cross than usual. As thanks to this unusual sand shroud, it appeared around the same time the events at Hyrule Castle took place. <laughs> it has blanketed the whole desert, including our town. And not long after that, swarms of monsters we'd never seen before began attacking. We've called them Gibdos. Physical attacks don't work well against them. They're slow, but they're s but they still make investigating the sand shroud difficult. Were you watching just now? Hmm. I've been practice I've been practicing striking that dummy over there with lightning. If I can aim the lightning well, I think it may be an effective weapon against the Gibdos. Hmm. But this technique is unrefined. I only recently discovered it and still need more practice. I want to master this power so I can use it to defeat the Gibdos. If I can do that, we can investigate the source of the Sand Shroud and search for Zelda as well. <clears throat> Link, will you help me with my training? I think I can use your arrows to help me aim my lightning strikes. Fire one at that dummy over there. Alrighty. Hey! Ooh. Ah, there we go! Now let's try something a little trickier. <clears throat> Aim for those dummies over there. Maybe we can hit them all with a single lightning strike? Here's an idea. Don't try to hit a specific dummy. Instead, aim for the area in the middle of all three. Like, right around where that rock is jutting out. Oh, but keep in mind that the farther away a target is from me, the longer it will take me to build up the energy to hit it. Okay. Nah. Did I get him? Not quite. Okay. There we go. <laughs> yes! I'm getting the hang of it now. The Gibdos don't stand a chance against this power. Oh? I can't thank you enough for your help, Link. Ling -ling -ling. Oh? What was that? Mm. It didn't sound like any noise the sand shroud has made, that's for sure. You heard that too, right? It was... <gasps> Chief! We received word that a swarm of Gibdas are attacking Karakara Bazaar. Buliara is already on her way there. She's already... Okay, understood. Thank you. <laughs> Link, we need to head to Karakara Bazaar at once. I must ask for your help once again. My lightning and your guiding arrows make us a formidable pair. Do you remember Karakara Kar 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 Bazaar? It's the oasis northeast of G Gerudo Town. Let's show those Gibdos what we're made of. No, we're not going together? Okay. Fine, fine. I'll just jump in the cave here, yep, just so I can do this. Here we go. Yay. Cutscenes. I don't get up a whole lot in this. Oh. 
Don't let any more Gibdos get close. <laughs> if help doesn't arrive soon. Hey. <laughs> Sorry to keep everyone waiting. But I'm here now. We're going to wipe all the Gibdos out at once. Follow me! Link, don't let me down. Don't let me down. Those monsters stand no chance. Alright. More? Where are they? Oh! more. Oh yeah, they're just coming out of the sand in general. Oh, fun. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> Be able to get a lot of Gibdo bones from this, maybe. Seeing where they are? Hmm. So our Gibdos seem to be coming from there. Oh, ew. Hate that. We need to destroy that somehow, otherwise they'll overwhelm us. Well done holding the line until we were able to get here. Now that we know the Gibdos are susceptible to lightning, this gives us a major advantage. Huh. Is that Zelda? Nope. Oh yeah, I could barely see her walking that way. Jeez. She was heading directly toward those tornadoes. And if more Gibdos are hiding in the storm. Uliara, we need to get back now. <laughs> Link, we're going on ahead. I'll meet you in town. Okay. Let's just... Oh. There we go. Hmm. <sighs> 
shelter. Hmm. Look, Link. There's a Gibdo hive, just like the one that appeared near Kara Kara Bazaar. Hmm. Both the hive and those tornadoes were reported to have shown up at the same time, too. But it's not only one hive. There are three to deal with, each just outside the town gates. I don't need a clairvoyant sand seal to know a massive Gibdo attack is coming. Oh. Right now, those hives are durable and nearly impervious to attack. But when they open and begin releasing Gibdos, they're vulnerable. The Gibdos won't wait outside our walls forever. Mm. So when they launch their attack, that's our chance to strike. And just as you said... Come. Come. To where I am. Okay. Again, you heard it, didn't you? Come. Is it calling out to us? Mm hmm? My dear Aizu, Link, is something the matter? I thought... It's nothing. <laughs> Link, for now, we should focus on protecting Gibdo Town... Gibdo Town, I mean, right now it is a Gibdo Town, but Gerudo Town from the enemies at our gates. We must prepare for battle. Okay, how can I help? Go to the tear from within the sand shroud while the hives and the tornadoes loom ominously over Gerudo Town. A mysterious voice reaches out to you. Uh, oh. This is important. You should continue to work with Raiju and the others. Okay, what do you need me to do? <laughs> the sand shroud, the sudden appearance of the Gyptos and their hive. Strange events keep happening one after another, and we saw Zelda near Kara Kara Bazaar, but she hasn't been seen anywhere around Gerudo Town. <laughs> There's something bigger going on, but for now, we need to focus on the problem at hand and prepare to fight. Link, I need your help again. Speak with Buliara and the soldiers, and help us organize our defenses. Oh. Do you have any questions about preparing? What's the plan? Oh. Talk to Captain Tyke Take in the yard. Work with her to decide how best to deploy our forces. Oh. Pata is in the courtyard. She's in charge of the materials we have on hand. We should reinforce our defenses with them. If you need anything, you should talk to her. Oh. Do you have questions about preparing for battle? Nah, oh. I'll it. Very well, in that case, please report to Lady Raiju. When the battle begins, I will be focused on protecting her. For the sake of the Gerudo, nothing can happen to her. Hives of monsters have appeared outside the town walls. It won't be long before we'll need to deal with this threat. How should we deploy our forces? Who should we send and where? We should spread them out to lightly cover all the gates, or maybe a concentrated force to protect a weakened position. Ah. We need to decide who to send where. We'd like to hear your thoughts. God. Cannon here. Where should we deploy them? I don't know. <laughs> I can't even look at my uh, log for this. Um, Northgate. Ah. Uh. Oh. 
Oh. Sword oh. trips. Eastgate. Oh. Ah. Spear oh. trips. Westgate. <laughs> ah. Okay, let's talk about defenses now. I'm gathering materials that I think might be useful in battle. Feel free to take anything you need from here. Also, I'm confident that I can build a barricade at any of the gates. Would that help? Let's talk barricades. Ooh. There are three gates from the palace. The north gate is ahead and the west gate is left. The east gate is right. I got an idea for a barricade. I'll use iron barrels and wood to block the path. Which gate should I set it up at? North gate. That way we can defend the cannon a bit better. Oh. Okay, the barricade has been set up at the north gate. That should slow down any em enemies that attack that position. Ah. Oh. Ooh. Ah. Oh. These materials. Mm. Oh, yes, I gathered up some weapons and materials to improve them. There's also some food. Oh, and some rupees. Some of the troops found these strange capsules while patrolling, so those are here too. And of course, if things get really dire, like say if your bows all break or you run out of arrows in the middle of the battle, I can help you there too. It's okay for now. Oh. Gerudo Scimitar, that I bet's gonna be a weapon that uh, gets upgraded. Because so far we have the um, Boulder Breaker, the Light Scale Trident. I feel like the Rito's gonna be a bow, I need to visit them again, so I bet they'll be the, the single, the long sword of the Scimitar. So cool, okay. <laughs> Okay, so if I'm gonna do this, let's just drop the claymore then. Grab the scimitar. see what I can even make for this too. That'll be interesting. Because I do have the homing carts. I do have a shock emitter. Let's go here and talk to Hestu. I want to get some more item slots before the battle, too.
Uh, where is he? Over here. Uh, would he have gone back to Korok Forest after I'd saved the Deku Tree? Let's check real quick. Ah, <clears throat> uh, yeah, there he is. Cool, fine, whatever. Hey, you! It's you, we meet again! It's been a while, huh? I finally made it home to Kurok Forest! Korox told me that icky stuff floating in the air was making things weird around here. I'm so happy it's gone and that everyone is better now. Shock of Kala. Yeah, I have Korox seeds. Let's try one of each. 25. Oh gosh. One of each. Cool. Alright. Okay. have one the automated ally Automated ally.
I think the ally will be able to help just in general. Alright, we'll save it here. Hopefully won't get too overran. <laughs> hmm. Curious about that voice we heard earlier, but hmm. Hmm? Yeah. Situation report. Large number of Gibdas are moving to attack the town. Before anything else, we'll need to deal with this. Oh, Okay. Uh. Bulihara, they have the town surrounded. <laughs> Stay strong! This threat is also an opportunity. Fight well and we can wipe them out in one battle. Hives and all! <laughs> yeah. Prepare yourselves for battle. Let's show them the true power of the Gerudo! Ooh. Everyone. Protect our chief! Protect our town! Monsters have appeared outside town. Shore up the defenses at the gate! <clears throat> I will be in overall command here. Mark targets with your arrows and I will unleash my lightning on them. What's more, my control over my lightning continues to improve. With time to charge up, I can hit distant targets. Alright! Be safe here. Let's Enemies have emerged from the hive at the east gate. Stop them. Crap. The east gate would be this one. Oh no, this one. Yes. So is that the one I'm headed towards? <laughs> yes. Okay, good. I didn't need to make that then. Whoops. Oh well. Enemies from the hive near the west gate. Let's hit it with lightning. Enemies have been spotted inside town. Did they break through the gate? Flying enemies from the hive at the north gate too. Don't let them overrun us. that on their own. Woo! Get out of here. Uh, get this way. The enemies won't stop coming until we wipe out all the hides. Gibdo guts. Dread guts of the defeated Gibdo. It's a to, that they're very effective, vitality rich ingredients that are useful in elixirs.
Oh, because I flew in. Ah, yeah. Incredibly grateful for your help in the battle. On behalf of all the Gerudo, thank you. I keep wanting to say Gibdo. <laughs> I suspect the Gibdo threat will calm down a bit now that they're wiped out. Now that we've wiped out the hives that were surrounding the town, hmm. I noticed that the hives crumbled into sand when we destroyed them. I wonder if the Gibdos have some kind of connection to the sand? Or maybe, maybe they're connected to the sand shroud. Did they make it? Did it summon them? Hmm. hmm. And then there's the voice that you and I both heard. A voice in lightning. This reminds me of something. Hmm. Link, there's something you should see. Come down to the mural in the underground shelter. Okay. Oh, I forgot there was a... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I need to explore town more and find more of like the Gerudo uh, sewers. Maybe I'll find the statuey things there. Oh. Savak. Savak, you handled yourself well in the battle. It was quite a sight to see. You absolutely earned your share of the spoils. Help yourself. Thank you. <sighs> Gibdo parts are off are often used to improve weapons. The only real downside to them is their own brittle nature. Yeah. If they'd last longer, it'd be best, but... Ah, well. We did it!
Oh, Link, you came. Look at the mirror on this wall. Hmm. This is thought to have been painted by the ancestors of the Gerudo. It appears that when they created it, they were also using the shelter to hide. Perhaps the Gerudo of the past were also beset by some great disaster. Anyway, the writing on the mural says, hmm. Standing back to back with the throne witness... Standing back to back with the throne, witness red pillars across a vast sea. Unite the pillars in light to reveal the lightning stone and open the way. You who can hear my voice, come to me. I await you. That mysterious voice that spoke to us. Its words reminds me of this mural. This image must represent a location of some kind, and the engraved words are a riddle to discovering its location. It's the only explanation that makes sense. Red pillars and light. Hmm. Writing on it says, standing back to back with the throne, witness red pillars across the vast sea. Unite the pillars and light to reveal the lightning stone and open the way. 
Mm. I'm in the shelter somewhere, but no matter where I look, it's possible they were destroyed or altered when the town was constructed. Ah. in here, would it? Is in there, son of a gun. When the glow of the blood, blood moon, moon yes, shines I know, on Zelda. The I know. I know. Why, why can't I skip? There we go. <laughs> okay. Back down into the sewer. Count me in. Hi. Everyone, pay attention. Today we're going to have a very special lesson. We have a Vo with, here with <laughs> us today. Just try to relax and be your regular normal selves when you're talking to him. All right. Oh. Nolly, I know you can do this. Mm. Teacher, I... I... I can't. I can't look directly at his face. Oh. That's okay. 
we can stop here for now. Mm. You'll have to do something about that fear eventually. But I think once you muster the courage to face a foe, even just one time, your fear will wash away forever. Hi, keyboard. How you doing? <laughs> Death by snoo snoo. <laughs> No, I'm sorry. I imagine that was a bit unexpected, wasn't it? You see, she's never seen a Vo in person. She's only seen them in drawings or in recreations like the Vo dummies. Mm -hmm. I suspect that you hid your that if you hi hid your face, it would be easier. It's probably just too early to make eye contact while chatting. I hope you aren't feeling discouraged, though. It would be wonderful if you visited class again. <laughs> Sar Sarkso for taking the time today. Just need to hide my face? Easy! I have plenty of masks. <laughs> I'll be Link, the Lucha Libra. <laughs> Maybe not. This is where I, uh, count me in! <laughs> Hi. <laughs> oh. Alright, let's see if that works. <laughs> <laughs> Teacher I <laughs> Oh, it doesn't count. Okay. That's fine. I have others that I can try on. <laughs> That's fine. Uh what's another good mask? <laughs> the glide mask. The miner's mask. Oh gosh. All of these are just. Eh, they'd probably be mad about the Yiga mask. Um. <laughs> it's technically a mask. Will she like mm -hmm. the fierce deity more? We'll see. <laughs> Hi. Guessing maybe a mask like the first game. <laughs> oh yeah, I should try the cartoon link. Just I think it's uh it's the awakening mask, so I think it's from Link's Awakening, the remake. <laughs> oh. Teacher, I. Uh, uh, ah, she still can't. Okay. Uh, mm. <sighs> mm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this should do fine, right? The Lionel? <laughs> No way that it looks like an actual... <laughs> if this doesn't oh. work, then yeah, it's a specific mask that, I don't know. Maybe the Yiga. Oh, oh okay, there we go. <laughs> hey, I can talk to him like this. <laughs> so, uh, hi, my name is Nolly. <laughs> I make an amazing wild berry crepe. And I hope to share one I've made with a Vo someday. Oh. All right, that's enough. A. <laughs> Ma. Amazing job, Nolly. Vo are known to think with their stomach sometimes, so mentioning your cooking was a good idea. They're especially susceptible to sweets, so well done with the wild berry crepe. Oh. Sark so to you as well. It was very kind of you to conceal your face for Nolly. It seems like that's just the thing she needed to get past her anxiety and talk to you. <laughs> you are more than welcome to return to the class in the future. Anything mm. else? Hi. <laughs> oh. Britana, let's see what you can do. Don't worry, I look like a Lionel. You don't have to worry about it. <sighs> Uh, Pratana? <laughs> I can't do it. I think I need that drink from the canteen to give me energy. Mm. 
Are you okay? Let's not push you too hard today, alright? We'll just stop there. Oh. It's great that when someone reaches outside their comfort zone to try something new. But no one should ever force that kind of breakthrough. Drink from the canteen. Mm. Bar an uncommon sight to most of the Vi here, so hopefully you can forgive the reaction. <laughs> Don't be discouraged, though. It would be great to have you visit us again. And of course, Sarkso for spending time here today, too. Uh, Cantina was where again? Not here, not there. Nope. Yes, let's jump in the fire. Canteen. Looking real good. <laughs> Basa. Basa. Mm. I heard a new vibe is coming to town. Special first of my signature drink. <laughs> but, but what is it? Do you have a picture of it? Not really. Huh? So you know that the Vo that's been locked up in jail? Oh. oh yeah, the one that used the sand shroud to try to sneak into town? Mm -hmm. What about him? Mm. A little while ago, I went to grab something from that shelf over there. And while I was standing there, I swear I heard someone say, Aklet. Mm -hmm. Hey! I've heard Aquette before. I think that's the name of Perda's Vevi. Oh. You know, the jail is just on the other side of that wall. The wall behind the shelf, I mean. Mm. But I'm wondering if maybe it's Pedra's husband locked up in there. Oh. That reminds me of something I heard when Pedra came back to the town with little Aquette in, in tow. Didn't the guards mention they'd seen a Vo wandering about outside the town around then? Eh? That has to be who it is. <sighs> Most everyone who's has been avoiding eye contact with this foe, including me. Can I get in there through here then? Get my way, vases. Or maybe a set. <laughs> Oh, I can! Yeah! No worries, I don't even really care about you. There we go! Now I just need one more. Huh? You... Where did you come from? Oh. Must be nice to be able to come and go as you please. Meanwhile, I'm just in this cell. It isn't all bad, though. I'm able to see my daughter Aklet every day, from a distance anyway. Mm. I haven't seen Pedra at all. It's been a little tough on the old spirit. She told me once that she would plan to work at a clothing store in Gerudo Town, but I haven't seen her walking by. Aklet probably knows something, if only I could speak to her. No one likes a loud, annoying prisoner. Still, while I am curious, as long as they're both happy and healthy, I'm happy too. What? Pedra's working at a place called the Rudo Secret Club. Oh. oh, that's what the clothing store is called. What an unusual name. <laughs> well, I'm happy to hear that she's doing well. Oh, man. She must be working so hard to support Aklet up there at that shop. <laughs> that's it. I can do my part by watching over Aklet while she's away. I'll just have to be from inside the cell. Oh, gosh, Wobbin. Is that the Lionel stance? Like, just the arms out to the side like that? Let me... Uh, different head, just so I can see. Yep! It totally is! <laughs> nice. Gotta get into the... Gotta get into the spirit of things, right? All right, so just looking for one more steel down below.
Come on. There you go, Link. Found another Stell. Stella? Show me. I still don't know that word. I just steal. Mm. Let's see. It says the seven heroines who protected the Gerudo. Their power is housed within the seven spirits. Mm. Curious. Does this mean that the seven heroines' powers have changed form, even now that they are gone? What could be meant by spirits? <laughs> what if spirits refer to orbs like this one? Sayo Ten, I believe I've made a breakthrough. Hmm. I'm curious about what might be written on the seals. Do you have any more to show me? Here you are. Oh. I don't have any. Eh? Only one remains. You have brought us close to learning the truth about the heroine Sark. Mm. Find one more. The shelter isn't so big, and yet I still can't find them anywhere. Possible they were destroyed or altered when the town was constructed. Ah. Mm. All right. Where's another place I've not been able to go to, or that might be destroyed from down here in the shelter? Found that one. Damaged or altered. Got one in there.
Sorry, once the sand trap clears up, I'll provide no guards. Uh -huh. Second half of the guards have been training hard to improve their desert mobility. I went where I ride you became chief, grew to town, faced a major crisis. After it was ro resolved, I ride you swore that our military forces would be prepared to face any new threats that came along. Uh -huh. Fortunately, that was a tougher task than anyone thought. Luckily, Lady Raiju's close friend, Princess Zelda, came to visit. More in touch with the desert itself. The new training regime, that's what I heard. Hmm. Hey, I'll go first person and just look around with my camera. Maybe you'll give me a hint. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh. The items. Uh, actually, open ooh, the door. Ooh. Oh wait, wait, I went back in! and then we'll just continue on. I just get lost in this place easily. So maybe something to drink at the canteen. I guess I never did talk to her. Hip. 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 
Alright, alright, alright. I don't think it's here. I'll try looking some more once we got this complete, I guess. Back to back with the throne. Yeah, that's me right now too, Link. Ah, no. Back with the throne, witness red pillars across the vast sea. Unite the pillars in light to reveal the lightning stone and open the way. Okay, so back to back. Fell down the well. See, I see that. That what I'm supposed to be going to? Unite the pillars in light to reveal the lightning stone. Oh, yeah. Um, let's try on... First things first, I want to be able to move better in the sand. So let's do sand boots. Might as well just do this and that. Oh, that's still not quite what I need. Alright, there we go. I am weak, but I'll be able to get by alright, I think. Hurry, give dudes. Taking me to that dragon's exile.
that I need to break there. Maybe. I feel like I need to somehow get the light to hit the mirror here, but I don't know how.
Okay, let's go over here. Um, I'm a guess if this is not where I'm meant to be, it's going to be right in the middle of the uh, beams or lights. Okay, it just wasn't quite lined up. The Triforce. Hey, I've seen that before. Uh, do I need to go to raise you for that? 
Perhaps at the center. No! Duh. I just hope I don't overshoot it. <laughs> See that link? It's Zelda. But now she's gone. You distracted me. Uh. What? She's gone. Where did Zelda go? Hmm. I saw the lights of the red pillars and hurried here as quickly as I could. It cannot be a coincidence that we've seen someone who looked like Zelda twice, but a mystery for an but a mystery for another oh? time. Did you solve the mural's riddle and cause this to appear? I'm impressed. If I remember correctly, the mural said unite the pillars and light to reveal the lightning stone and open the way. Oh. Maybe my lightning strike is the key. Here we go. So we had two in the sky, one in the depths, and now one on surface. All right, cool, cool. Raiju's lightning power. When Raiju's aura is charged, you can call on her for a lightning attack. Excellent. Also, what's uh, attacking? Oh. <laughs> Lightning Temple. The mural's myth risen from the sands. Lightning Temple, though. Okay. Oh, no! Oh, that sucks. <laughs> Queen Gibdo, Scourge of the Lightning Temple.
All oh, right in the face. Like the other gift. Our attack should be effective now. <sighs> Nothing but sand wherever we look. Where did it go? You okay? <laughs> Come on, get up! Okay. Okay. Hmm. It flew up to the t toward the roof. Maybe there's some way to go up after it inside the hmm. structure. Come on, Link. Let's look for a way in. Can't, can't I just climb? I've got a lot of stamina, you know? I feel like I could. <laughs> oh yeah, as long as I got elemental attacks, Gibdos are nothing. nice. It is a fresh one too, so I think <laughs> And 
I am inside the dungeon, so I should be fine from the heat. Basement one. Make it impossible to go further.
Yeah. See, not possible at all. Never. We are like never stuck. stuck. Feels the more like stopped. a. I'm on my way, Link. Feels like a more traditional uh, dungeon now. Not gonna lie, kind of like it. <laughs> ah, what? area. Yep, as soon as I get over here, it's gonna door close. Oh, we're not. Okay. Not gonna lie, Sidon is frickin' powerful here. Everyone is, really. Except for maybe our bird friend. He doesn't have any elemental attacks. Everyone else does, though. So they're great for this. Room of Hopeful Life. Come on, then. Ow. Nice! There we go. 
now. now that wouldn't be too bad let's do it <laughs> all right good 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 I'll go with this this soldier blade this soldier blade there we go Oh, my God. 
Room of Ascension. Uh. Link, I'm certain that the mirror we saw in town was trying to guide us here. I believe we'll also find whoever that voice we've been hearing belongs to. started to rise, then slam back down. Daughter. Daughter of the Gerudo. This platform connects to the very top of this temple. Use your power to charge the four batteries, and it will function once more. Heed my words. I heard the voice very clearly just now. It's calling to me. It said that I should use my power to charge the four batteries. Mm. The monster we fought outside earlier fled to the top of this temple. And the voice that has been speaking to us said the platform should be able to take us all the way up there. If that's true, we, should, we could corner the monster at the top. We might also figure out who is talking to us and why. Mm. Okay, Link. We need to get to the very top. To start, we should do what that mysterious voice suggested and try to find those four battery devices. Alright. do anything with these mirrors yet. There's no light. <laughs>
is going to be a problem. Where is she? She's still just down here. Do I need to talk to her and
didn't mean to do that one. There we go. So this is one of the batteries. It seems to have absorbed my lightning well enough. All right, three left. I think I'm gonna leave it there for today. I've been streaming for a bit. And I'll pick this back up tomorrow. 
or maybe later. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. I might play uh, Minecraft Mod Pack with Hark and Rabbit on stream. We'll see, though. I know I said I might yesterday, but I had a horrible migraine. <laughs> I'm feeling much better today, though, so I should be able to do something later today, at least. All right. Until then, though, I hope that y'all have a good day. Thank you, Keyboard Zombie, for chatting with me in the chat. I appreciate it. Um, also, I need to check and see, make sure my chat overlay was working. I meant to check that, but oh well. I'll check back in the vault. I'll look back. All right. Anyway, thank y'all for watching. I appreciate it. Talk to you next time. I hope you have a good rest of your day. Bye!